detail some of these text messages in their affidavit of probable cause against this former teacher. And they say that while there are none that are listed in this complaint that are sexually explicit in nature, they say that some of these messages were about having a deep love with a student and running away with her, even trying to adopt her. Now, this teacher has been out of the classroom for weeks, and tonight she's in the Allegheny County Jail. Can you please tell me why? I'll explain to you. 28 year old Geraldine Alcorn asked police why she was being taken into custody. Investigators said it was because she sent 2,400 text messages to an 11 year old female student at Beachwood Elementary School over a two week period. Those messages, police said, included Alcorn and the girl expressing a deep love for one another, and Alcorn allegedly talking about taking the girl away from her home and going on the run for a while. Hi, Miss Alcorn. Yeah. Hi, can we talk with you? We're with Channel 4. Can we talk with you about the charges against you? No, I'm sorry. I mean, we're doing the story. We'd really like to have your input. Did you text message this student repeatedly? I'm sorry, no. I'm, so, I'm not. You know, the police are looking for you? We asked Alcorn about the texts. Is there anything at all you'd like to say? And can you just explain what was going on? Why you, these text messages were happening? Were you in love with this student? It said there was a deep love. Can you just elaborate on what was happening? There's a lot of accusations in here. Before police showed up minutes later to arrest her, Alcorn was suspended in February when Pittsburgh Public Schools learned of the allegations. She resigned in March, but police say not before leaving secret messages behind for this 11 year old girl to call her. Now, Alcorn's arraignment is scheduled for 3 o'clock in the morning. At that time, they will set her bond and also schedule a preliminary hearing date. Reporting live outside the Allegheny County Jail, Ashley Hardway, Pittsburgh's Action News 4.